video is actually sponsored by Basin in-ear monitors. Now, this is the third version that I've had. I actually had their B-Singers, their B-Singer Pros, and now their Tempos 5. All right, so um, what's special about these are their volume control. So it comes with a cord that allows you to control the volume. And yeah, I'm about to open this up and show you guys what comes with it. And we'll take it from there. It also comes with a user manual. It comes with a lot of ear sleeves. It also comes with adapter, a quarter inch. So we got here, we got one cord. That's like a, a white silver type cord. And you have this black cord that actually, this one has the volume control on it. The other one doesn't. And I really like these in-ears. They're really solid. And um, they actually, they do a great job staying in your ears to not be custom. I've had some times where it came out a little bit and all you have to do is literally just push them back in your ear and you're, you're good. Real easy to set up. Now, the main thing I like about their in-ears is the fact that it has a lot of sound isolation, man. And I need that, especially when I'm doing covers. I don't really want to hear drums raw like that. Like it's, I love the fact that it literally takes the background noise com almost completely away. And when I'm playing to a track, I can't even hear it. I just hear what the mix is on Logic Pro. All right, so it's right. But yeah, man, like, um, I'm actually, these might be actually my favorite ones. It goes from this one, then the B-Singer Pros, and then the B-Singers. Those are the ones I've, I've had a chance to work with. I haven't tried the Masters yet, but um, yeah, these are just, I, I'm loving them. Yep, and they're in. So let's go over the pros and cons of these in-air monitors. So let's start off with the pros. They fit great. They look great, they sound great. The sound isolation is by far my favorite thing about these in-air monitors. Um, yeah, yeah, very affordable, very affordable. The cons, um, basically it's only two issues I have. One would be the length of the cord. I wish this cord was actually longer because the length that it is now, I, I have to put my interface like really close to me just to plug them in. Like, the, my interface is right by my leg, by the hi-hat. So, yeah, it's a little too close. But if this was longer, it would be perfect. Another con would be, I actually did more research on the value control cord. This only works if your cord is connected to your phone and you're calling someone. Other than that, they're great. That's it for today's video. Make sure to hit that like button. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Make sure to subscribe to my gaming channel to enter in that 10K giveaway. And I'll see you guys next time.